North Carolina had a tough OT loss last week to Duke. They rebounded with a dominant win over Georgia Tech, and this week they take on their in-state rival, NC State. First half, Trevor Lacey from the outside with the fadeaway three, drains it. NC State will go up 11-7 with just over 10 minutes for left. Kayla Martin, this time wide open for three, putting the Wolfpack up 14-10. Marcus Page drives down the middle the lane, misses the floater, but Kennedy Meeks with the rebound putback brings UNC within four points. However, Ralston Turner from the top of the arc drains another North Carolina State three, putting them up 24 to 16. Second half, Jackson with the steal. Ball is slapped away, but Marcus Page with a diving assist to keep the layup transition. Brings UNC within six points as the crowd goes wild. Lacey from the, from the corner misses the three, but Anya with the rebound put back. Lacey, pump fake, drives down the middle of the lane, gets the hoop and the harm. That would basically seal the game as NC State wins 58-46. Now on the Maryland, Des Wells in transition with the layup and the foul. Des Wells again, this time drives and dunks it. He had 26 points, seven rebounds, and four assists in this game. Just over a minute left. The big man, Kaminsky in the paint, off the glass, gets the layup. Brings, with, brings Wisconsin within three points. However, Mel Trimble from the top of the key, drives, gets the hoop, and the harm. He had 16 points in this game, and Maryland will go on to upset the number five team in the country, 59 to 53. Now to the NBA. The Golden State Warriors have the best record in the league, and barring any late season collapse, look to be the number one seed in the West. It's really amazing what Steve Kerr has put together. The Warriors now taking on the Wizards. First half, Warriors steal and a long pass to Steph Curry, who gets the easy two. Washington up 12 to 11. Curry with the three, as usual, ties it, ties the game at 24. Curry with some handles and another three, even with a defender in his face, putting Golden State up 30 to 26. But just as the first quarter expires, John Wall sinks a floater to bring Washington within two points. John Wall drives again, this time with an assist to Marcin Gortat. John Wall again spreading the love. Chris Humphreys from the top of the key nails it as time expires for halftime. Now Iggy, from the corner, drains the three, puts Golden State up 105 to 99. Now Curry with the inbound pass to Harrison Barnes, who gets the easy two. Golden State now up by another two, 107 to 99. John Wall drives and gets the layup, but however, it would prove to be not enough as Steph Curry kisses it off the top of the glass. Golden State will go on to win this game, 114 to 107. Now we go to the Motor City. James has it stolen, but steals it right back. And since there's no piston defenders, he's going to get that two points every time. Eight to six, Cleveland. Kevin Love from outside, who drains the three-pointer, putting the Cavs up 17 to eight. Now Tayshaun Prince going coast to coast, turning back the clock and dunking on the Cavaliers' defense. Score, 17-14 Cleveland. James with the behind-the-back assist to Kevin Love, who drains another three in this game, putting the Cleveland up 44-37. Now, Catavius caldwell Pope from outside, drains it, ties the game at 44 with just under five minutes left in the second quarter. Now James drives, and the ball ends up in Love's hands again for a three. And another three. He had a career-high eight three-pointers in this game. Now James with the one-on-one, -on -one, drives, gets the foul, and the basket. He will also make the free throw. And with a little icing on the cake, Kyrie, after a scramble, this is it to Tristan Thompson, who gets the easy two. Cleveland will go on to win this game, 102 to 93. They've won 17 out of the last 19 games. Finally today, we take a spin around the world of sports in our plays of the day. To MSG. Ryan McDonough to Kevin Hayes, who shots the flex off the post, and JT Miller thinks he has an open goal, 
but the shot is saved by Kari Rama. Take another look as Rama, as Rama extends his glove and saves the wide open goal. Louisville Georgia Tech, Jorgensen passes out to Hedrick Jackson and with a monster slam over Louisville's Chinano Anawaku. Take another look as Tadrick Jackson goes along the baseline and serves an absolute facial to Anawaku. And the student section behind him is loving it as well. Now we get on to Florida. Daytona 500, 33rd lap. Jeff Gordon gets turned in the middle of the pack, setting off a multi-car wreck. He would finish 33rd. This brought out the yellow flag and consequently made Joey Logano the 2015 Daytona 500 winner as he's enjoying his win in victory lane along with the rest of his crew.